In this video, I'm going to be turning this piece of hickory. It's dimensional lumber, eight quarter by about nine and a half, and I'm going to be doing a paint effect on it with uh, color changing paints. So let's get it turned around so we can get the uh, to the rim and get some paint up. Okay, so I've got the face sanded now, and I didn't notice before on this piece, but there's this some fiddleback right in here. Well, we used to call fiddleback anyway, and this brown stripe. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate this from the rest of it. I'm going to paint this part, leave this natural. So I'm going to go ahead and tape this off. It's good, so I'm going to spray down this way so I can try to keep everything off of the, the outside of the bowl, if at all possible. Make sure I fill the grain real good. I'll probably have to put a couple of coats. Put this one on and I'm going to let it dry and then I'll come back with you. Alright, so everything's good and dry now, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take these half-inch dowel pins. I don't know if you can see the dowel pins, but they're corrugated for the glue. This is for doweling. So I'm going to use the corrugation as a texture. Put some screws on here so that I can just roll it around. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some use some color-changing paint. And uh, let's see how it works out. Then let's see what it does. We get some more paint. And I'm just going to go random on here. I have three different colors. This aquamarine, a purple, and a red. So I'm just going to 
the random random texture here. And I'll have to let this one dry for a little bit before I grab the other colors because they'll they'll smear each other. And the purple definitely has a dramatic color difference. I don't know if you can see it, but see the color change in it. It's pretty dramatic. The other two colors are not that, not that dramatic. Um, the red especially doesn't have that big of a change, but the aquamarine does. You look at it one side and it's kind of blue, and then the other side it's kind of a, like a dull gray maybe. All right. I gotta remember my rim, my fall is gonna be in here, so. So I peeled the tape off, and this is what we got. So it looks pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and try to cut a ball out. Try not to get way out here. Leave some of this grain in here because it's really pretty. It's kind of plain over here, but really pretty over here. It's got the, the fiddle back in it. So let's get this thing turned out. I get that sanded out. Put some brace of paste on there, and then we'll get some some finish on here. All right, so I've got everything sanded. I'm gonna put some spray enamel on here, and uh, after I get everything sprayed and everything, and it dries, then I'll come back and and show you what it looks like. All right, 
so here's the finished product. Color changing paints. Pretty piece of hickory. Got some fiddle back in here. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you on the next one.